Hi and welcome to a new video. When you download a file to your iPhone, it can be confusing because you don't know where the file was saved. In this video, I'll show you how to locate the downloaded files on your iPhone. Let's go! Locating your downloaded files may depend on what type of file you downloaded. If you're just downloading an image in Safari, tap on it to view the image, then long press the photo. And you can either copy it or tap Add to Photos so it will be saved to your Photos app. When you open the Photos app, you'll have the photo under the Recents tab. If, for example, you're downloading a document file or a PDF file, tap on the Share icon here, scroll down to view the full list of options, and choose Save to Files. Here, you can choose whether you want to save it on iCloud Drive or store it locally on your iPhone. This iCloud Drive option is only available when you are logged into your iCloud and it will be synced to other devices linked to your iCloud account. The other option is to store it locally on your iPhone. For now, I'll download the PDF on my iCloud Drive in the Downloads folder. Hit Save at the top right corner to confirm. Now, go back and open your Files app. If you can't find the app, go ahead and download it from the App Store. On your Files app, select the location where you saved your file. In my case, I downloaded it to iCloud Drive, then Downloads. Here is the downloaded PDF file. With the Share button, you can share the file and attach it to an email or send it through WhatsApp or AirDrop. On the bottom, you can see how much storage is available on your iCloud. If you long press on the file, it will give you a bunch of options including rename, move, share, or delete. Remember that you can only download files into iCloud Drive and sync your files between devices, is if you are logged into your account and you have enough storage. Just make sure that you have iCloud Drive enabled and you're good to go. One thing to keep in mind is that the Files app doesn't have that many features, especially when you want to share files to a Windows computer. So, I recommend using Documents app as an alternative to the Files app. You can get it from the App Store for free. You can find the download link in the video description below. Here you have your files and folders and an amazing feature is that you can easily transfer files between your computer and your iPhone by tapping on this computer button here. I have a video explaining this feature. Just tap on the tag in the top right corner or click on the link in the video description below to get more information. And that's it. If I could help you, feel free to give this video a thumbs up and don't forget to subscribe. Leave a comment down below if you have any questions. See you next time. Bye.